Right. The program will explain how to download the file from share your at SharePoint site. Let's start. First thing, we just go to tool, include the reference of Microsoft Internet Control 6.0. So it will open the dialog box. There you press M to go to Microsoft Internet Transfer Control 6.0. You just put a tick mark, then you click OK. It will include the INET object for your current VBA project. So here first I just declare one FTP object as from INET object. Then site URL. That means here your FTP, sorry, your SharePoint site name, domain name, you can type it here. Here then file source. Inside your site, which folder contain your source file? That, that means which file you are going to download from your SharePoint site. The path you can specify. Then designation. That means in a locally where you are going to copy it. For example, in my drive, C drive, test folder, I am going to store the file with the same name. So these three you have to set that. Then by using set keyword, I am initializing the INET object FTP. Then for FTP, you have to set some properties. First one is URL. You just set the site URL. Already we saved that one. Then this is going to use this FTP protocol and your SharePoint site username and password. Then access type is by default only. Now download the file. You have to use the execute method of the FTP. So it contain dot URL. URL means uh, like this one, a cyber site URL. Here it will load. Then it's a get I use this one. This is used to download from SharePoint site to your local machine. In case if you want to upload the file, you have to use put instead of get. Then file source. That means your uh, SharePoint server uh, path. And here locally where you are going to store that path. That's all. So here. That's all. Once if I run this one, it will copy the file abc.xls from the sh my SharePoint site and it will stored here in test folder. Thank you.